Hi everyone, I have got my box from Black Friday special from Erin Condren, some sticker planner supplies. So I have been dying to open this and go through it with you. So I hope that you stick around and join me. Hi everyone, I'm Nancy and welcome back to my channel. I am so excited to have you join me again tonight and I just want to give a huge shout out again to my subscribers. Thank you, thank you so much. It means the world to me to have your support. I would be lost without you and I definitely could not do my channel without knowing that you're there for me. If you are new to my channel, I hope that you click on that little red subscribe button over there. I would love to have you come back and visit. I hope everyone gives this video a thumbs up. Your comments, of course, are always welcome because I really need your help on this planner thing. And of course, give this video a thumbs up. So anyway, on Friday, Black Friday, I did order some um, planner supplies from Erin Condren's website. She had a 30% off special and she also, you got two free uh, two-sided pens with every order. So anyway, I got this in. It shipped really fast. I'm excited to open it, but I wanted to do it with you. And so it's kind of been sitting on the floor. So today I decided to try to get a few uh, videos out of the way. I've got the same clothes on as I did in my Scentsy, but I did change out my little Nutcracker friends because they like to be shown and they like to, they like to be loved too. So anyway, uh, let's get into my Erin Condren box. So I've got it open, but you can't see it. Alrighty. So like the uh, seasonal box, it came with this little like newspaper type format, little brochure. Um, just giving you a few things. It's uh, got a few articles in it. It's going to, of course, show you some of the items that she has, how some people use them, how much they like their her products. And they also have like, um, you know, desk supplies and things to uh, brighten your desk to match your planners. So just some interesting things to read. Nice little package wrapped with tissue paper and of course a little Erin Condren sticker which I'm not sure if it's going to show. Enjoy. And of course I'm going to enjoy this. This whole planning thing is just totally new to me. It's like a whole world. I mean I thought I was going to get this planner like a calendar and days of the week and just kind of write things down. No. And once when I saw what people did with them I said I want to do that too. So okay so it's wrapped here in bubble wrap. Got a few things here. My pens. And let's put this on the floor so I don't knock anything over. So anyway, um, in my seasonal box, I got this uh, little folio that they call it. And you can put four of these little mini things in it. And it came with two of them. So one was like a dot journal, journaling type one. So it's just blank pages that you fill in, but it did have an index on it. So that if I did uh, use this maybe to put in some good recipes or some motivational tips from others, I could always list it right here in the index so that I can go through and find it quicker. And it also had this other one, which is really, really pretty for the weekly intentions and goals. And this is for someone that, oh my gosh, they have got to have the most organized mind in the world to use this. And it's tells you about goal setting, what's intentions, blah, 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 and just all kinds of things to write down. Well, that's probably a little too much for me because I'm pretty much a day-to-day -day type person and sometimes minute by minute. So long-term goals, no, I, that's not me. But I was thinking that I like the idea of this. This is maybe something portable that I can carry around with me. Maybe I could, you know, I like the idea of that dot journaling book for maybe putting in some recipes and things that I find that people, you know, are posting on their Weight Watcher sites and different tips like that. So I like the idea of that. But then I thought, well, they got other folio books to put in here because you can put up to four books in here. So got something to add in here. But of course, first I had to get some stickers. Because stickers is what makes it so much fun. So I got this one. And it's just two sticker sheets of the same one. 
and these it just says for the boutique planner so it would go in any of those books that go in the folio some just everyday icons some sayings and some ribbons to put things down this one is for uh, I got two for the for the a wellness log so again this has got two sheets of the same thing just some motivational sayings and it's foiled with gold so it just uh, you know it just kind of makes it pretty I love this you, you've got this start doing it make it happen keep moving forward make it happen be strong so just some nice motivational sayings that I love putting in my planner um, this is another one for the wellness log and again it would be I think I this one might be upside down there and um, oh and this is a sticker book it's got 276 stickers in here and this is the monthly collection edition 5 so this has got something um, for headers for like every month of the year and it's all in this pretty little book add a little confetti to each day so each one is going to have like a monthly title and then just some things for the month so january of course happy new year february is nice and pink for happy valentine's day we've got april enjoy the little things happy earth day June, some nice fun summery things. Looks like there's some washi on the bottom. July. Let's see what else we have. I won't go through everyone here and then October. So just some cute stickers to add to uh, monthly pages in the petite planners. Alrighty, so I this one is a wellness log. And of course it tells you right there that includes six months of weekly spreads, daily workout step, water intake and sleep trackers, food journals, goal in progress, wellness tips, and stickers. Plus it's pretty. So this will go right into that little folio. So I'll show you how that works in a minute. So we've got page there for your activity. Your water intake, hours slept. You can log down your your meals. Maybe if you track calories or if you track points, to keep track of that way. Um, thought I just saw something else that jumped at me that was a little different. And then from your monthly progress sheets, what your goals are, what you accomplished, what you want to do for the next month. And then your measurements, clothing sizes, things like that. And that's what I, I've had trouble keeping up with. I mean, I keep this log of all the steps that I take in my weight. But how my stylist from Stitch Fix and Mix and Match are keeping up with me because I haven't taken any new measurements or anything to send them. And I'm kind of guessing when I give them what I think my weights, my sizes are. So they're kind of going by how things fit for one month to figure out what to send me the next month. So... I should really start doing that plus you know I did have this scare a couple of weeks ago I got up in the morning um, and it, it was after I had four days off from, from work and when I'm at work I drink water all day long I take water with me that we've got filtered water at work and I just drink it constantly but when I'm home for some reason I don't I go into the kitchen to get water which I've got in the refrigerator I've got filter on my sink so plus bottled water that I buy and fruit flavored water but somehow when I'm home I grab coffee and of course I have decaffeinated coffee so that doesn't help so anyway for four days in a row I didn't drink that much water I had coffee just about all day long and when I got up to go to work on Monday morning I woke up about 5 30 I just couldn't sleep anymore and I got up and I was just very very lightheaded I was kind of dizzy I was nauseous and just it didn't feel right so I thought I'd go and get my blood pressure cup and just to see what, what was wrong. And I got about halfway down the hallway and I couldn't even walk anymore. So I just kind of sat in the hallway for a few minutes. Then I ended up taking a nap on the floor in the hallway. Um, get up. I didn't make it to get the cup. I just went back in the bedroom. It was too early to call and work. Plus if I called and work and I had to dial O uh, for work to get to the operator to leave a message, I'm the operator. So 
I would have left a message for myself. So I texted my boss and just said, look, I'm not feeling well. I'm going to go back to bed. I'll let you know later. So when I got up a couple hours later, I took my blood pressure and it was 89 over 40. And I have never, ever had low blood pressure, which explains um, why I was so dizzy and lightheaded. And I think it's because I just didn't drink enough water all weekend that I was just uh, kind of dehydrated. Plus, I was still exercising, but not drinking the water. So I want to try to keep better track of my blood pressure every day and um, water intake stuff like that so I'm thinking this is going to help me do that and of course there's some stickers in the back and this is going to go right into this folio book that's probably a little too much information than you uh, thought you were going to get today but anyway if it happens to me it could happen to anybody I've always had high blood pressure and um, you know I, I always figured that one day I would go to the doctor and get it checked out but but I didn't um, you know my blood pressure used to always be like 180 190 and over like 120 so yeah that's not good either so anyway I need to start taking better care of myself which is the whole thing of trying to lose weight this year that's part of it so also on her website she had these little mini planners that would go into that folio so these are separated into corner quarters They've all got a pretty cover and a little motivational saying on each of them. So let me see if I can see what it says. So it's a colorful vertical layout. It's got three months of planning, three monthly spreads, daily, mini months and checklist, progress of oh, note paper, some inspirational quotes and some stickers. So anyway, so I figured maybe this would be good to put in that folio too. Maybe do a little pre planning. Um, if I know something's coming up, I can write it in here and then later put it in my big journal. Or if I'm on the road, I could just kind of take this with me. So again, it's uh, set up like this. So you got these pages for, you know, this is Wednesday and Thursday, but you got these places here to put down list or appointments, any notes off to the side and stickers in the back. So again, this folio takes up to four, so I could change these out every month, just open it up, slide it in here, and this would be very carryable in my tote type pen bags or my laptop case that I take to work every now and then. And it's just something portable to have these books in here. Like I said, this folio takes up to four books. So it's up to me on how what books I want to put in here and how I want to use them. So that's what I've really got to think about is um, trying to use this to better. And it's, it's mainly for my health, but it's also um, to stay motivated. Like sometimes even though you know you have to do something, getting motivated to do it is not the easiest thing in the world. So again, there are four of these books by the quarters. And then we got these two free pens. So one's going to be that green pen and then a black one. And they've got like a fine side and then a thicker side for using in the uh, planners. So that was everything in my Black Friday Erin Condren haul. So I'm excited to I don't know what I'm, how I'm going to use these yet, but I know that I need to come up with a plan. So I'm hoping that maybe somebody has some great ideas on if they use this system and they use those petite planners, how do they use them? Do they use them more for pre-planning? Just kind of jotting down some thoughts and ideas. The wellness log, I think, is really going to help me uh, take control of my, just not my weight. It's, I mean, getting healthy isn't all about weight. It's about eating right and making smarter choices and you know the drill as much as I do but we don't always do it so hoping this helps me and I want to thank everyone for joining me I look forward to your comments and I hope that everyone goes out has a great day and we will chat again soon everyone bye bye